And one thing that I that we wanted to explore next is is this idea that we have one patent system that covers all business models and all technologies. Uh, <clears throat> for example, uh, we were talking with Hans Sauer this morning from Biotechnology Industry Organization, Bio, and w the question that was asked was, you have in biotechnology a a business model where you have a few patents covering the compound, the medicinal compound or whatever it is, whereas in electronics, well, with a smartphone or, or other type of product, you might have 10,000 patents, Judge, covering all the various features, functions, operations, telecommunications capabilities, battery power, displays, input-output devices, databases, you know, connections to the cloud, et cetera that go in to make this one single product. So do you think that one of the problems that might be going on here is that you have an industry that has 10,000 patents implicating their product versus another industry that embraces patents, the biotechnology industry, where there's only a few patents that cover the product? Or is that really a red herring? Uh, I think it's a red herring. You have to have a unified patent system. Uh, England, Germany, the European uh, countries, uh, and others, Australia, Canada, have a unified patent system. We've always had a unified patent system. It's complicated enough with a unified system. If you're going to create multiple parallel silo type systems for different technologies, you're going to create chaos, total chaos. Now, uh, we, you know, when, when, when we um, ask about uh, uh, the problem of multiple patents covering an electronic problem, product. Step back. Uh, when you buy a new electronic device to replace one you bought three or four years ago, isn't it vastly more capable and vastly cheaper than the one before and the one before and the one before? So we can't say that the patent system is blocking innovation in the electronic industry because a single product may have 10,000 patents. The innovation is going like gangbusters in the electronic uh, industry. Uh, so uh, I don't see any evidence from which one could conclude that the current unitary patent system is strangling any particular technology and certainly not electronic devices like smartphones. 